Hey folks, welcome back to Wisconsin Family. We're so excited to be here at Rosie's Coffee Bar and Bakery. And I'm standing next to Ronnie, who is a barista here at Rosie's, and she's gonna school us a little bit on the art of making coffee. Ronnie, welcome. Thank you. Thanks for, uh, thanks for allowing, allowing us to invade your space today. We appreciate that. So uh, I'm really excited to hear a little bit about this siphoning technique, or this uh, siphon that you use to make some coffee. Talk to us a little bit about that. What it does is it looks a little bit like a chemistry experiment, which it is, perfectly. Uh -huh. um, it makes a 16 ounce black coffee, and okay. the whole process, um, the heating of the water draws it up through a tube into mm -hmm. a glass basin on the top. And then we add the grounds in for the brewing process, and mm -hmm. once it's finished with its brewing portion, then we remove the heat and the cooling draws it back down through the tube, and there's a filter in between that just catches all those grounds and it's very smooth but it has a little bit of a smoky undertone. Mm. It's delicious. That is, and I, I had a cup earlier and it is delicious. So literally the the grounds are hitting this boiling hot water and how, how hot did you say the water was? It's around 200 degrees. That's very warm, very yes. warm. So you know you're getting a good cup of coffee because as I understand the more uh, the more hot the water is, the more it extracts the flavor from the ground. It does. Yep. Yeah. It's all very precise. Everything's weighed, measured, yeah. and timed. Yes. And um, yeah, very yeah. very precise here. And then you also do some espressos as well, and espresso and latte. Can you talk us a little bit about that process? We do. Um, we we train a lot on. Um, I don't even know how to just crop that part out. That's okay. So talk to us a little bit about the the process for making a making a good latte. We actually, it first starts with the type of machine that you use, and we use the T3 Simonelli, which was the 2012 through 2014 Barista World Championship espresso machine. Oh, wow, okay. So we start right off with a great machine, sure. um, the quality of the coffee, and we use JBC coffee, Yeah. which is Very, very highly rated there. coffee. Yes, very yes. highly. It's nationally rated. Yes, um, yes. So all uh, good ingredients, um, great machinery, everything is top quality over here. Right. So now you're going to talk to us a little bit about the, is it called latte art? Mm -hmm. So you're going to show us, give us a demonstration of how to make a swan in just a moment. So yes. uh, why don't you head over there and uh, get ready and, and show us. That'd be great. Thank you so much for showing us that. That is really, really cool. We're gonna go over to Jessa now and she's gonna to talk to us a little bit about some of the food that's offered here at Rosie's. Jessa? Thanks, Justin. Well, there's a lot more here at Rosie's Coffee Bar and Bakery other than coffee, believe it or not, and I've been learning, oh, Hey, there you go. I, you're talking about food. I've got to be a part of this. You wanted to jump so. in. I totally yeah. understand. I've yeah. actually been chatting with Bobby a little bit behind us, who's given me a little bit of a lesson in Rosie's food. Not that I needed it, though, because I am a customer here. I love their food. Right. It's absolutely fabulous. Well, I, I'm, you're, you're getting a little bit of an education, so talk to us a little bit about what you've learned. I mean, what, what kinds of things do they have here? So Rosie's does all kinds of great sandwiches. They do a fabulous breakfast. Mm -hmm. They have a full bakery, and everything they make is absolutely awesome outstanding. Very and, it, good. and it's all from scratch. Like what kind of ingredients do they yeah, have? Yeah, so this is a scratch bakery. Yeah. So we'll check out what they're doing in the back in just a little bit, but they are back there busy at work. So they use, Bobby was telling me, King Arthur flour, which is the best of the best if you are yeah. in the business. This is something to know. Yeah. Um, you know, real butter. They make everything from scratch down to the bread that their sandwiches are made on. And no preservatives or anything No like preservatives. That. And they have some great sandwiches that are made on a panini press that they have right here. Right. So a lot of great food. Lots of great food. Yeah, lots of good stuff. And we're yeah. gonna find out a little bit more about what's going on in their bakery. Did you want to yeah. head back there? Yeah. So no, I got a couple other things to cover real quick. So <laughs> no, not I yet. I will talk more about food. <laughs> uh, but they do a breakfast here that is amazing. They serve it from 6:30 a.m. until 10:30 a.m. So a pretty decent breakfast that they do. Some of their best sellers. One of my favorites is the quiche. That isn't the, actually the best seller, but the quiche is to die for. I recommend it. But they also do, named after Bobby behind us, they have Bobby's Biscuits and Gravy that they're kind Ooh. of known for. Very Biscuits nice. and Gravy are really good. 
Um, and then some of the best sandwiches. Now, Kaz is the owner, and we've had her on our restaurant show, but one of the best sandwiches is co the Cosmic Chicken Salad Sandwich. Cosmic. Have to have it. There you go. Bobby says it's the best, so you've got to do that one. Um, but what we are going to head back and learn a little bit more about is their baked goods. So, like I said, they've got a full team back there baking at all hours into the night even. And now, I know you were excited now for it. Now we can do it? Now, now can we, go? we get to go right. head back to the bakery, so let's go. Okay. And we are back in the bakery section of Rosie's Coffee Bar and Bakery, and this is kind of where it all happens. This is understand. where the magic happens, it's, back you know, here in the kitchen. The smell just gets better and better as you walk back here. So, yeah. uh, Jessa, you, you've been working with Rosie's for a while on the restaurant show, yes. kind of behind the scenes a little bit, but can you talk to us a little bit about what some of the best sellers they have uh, oh from their God. baked goods? So their bakery is outstanding. Mm. Not that I know from personal experience, but everything that they make is really good. <laughs> And, um, you know, donuts are kind of an up-and-coming thing. Like, They're making a comeback. They are making a comeback. Yeah. It's so true. So they have a donut here that is to die for, the ma maple bacon donut. Not only is it a tongue twister, but it's amazing. You heard it right. There's bacon on There's, this it donut. Is, but it's amazing. And I'm not even a big bacon fan, but I love this donut. Um, if you want good cinnamon rolls, hands down, best cinnamon rolls in the Madison area, easy. And Probably in Wisconsin. And one of the things to note is that not only is it good quality, but it's a good quantity too. They're huge. Cinnamon rolls as big as your head. Yeah, and I've literally. eaten a whole one, so yeah. I have no shame. Right. Um, but these guys do a lot of other things too. Their cake is outstanding. In fact, Kaz, the owner here, made me my very first Mother's Day cake ever. Oh, that's nice. And uh, I didn't even have any help to eat it. Of course, you don't yeah, eat it. It took me a couple days, but I ate the whole right. thing. Yeah. Um, and it's amazing. But they do cakes for Mother's Day is a great example. That's a ways away. But they do birthday showers. Birthdays, showers. Birthday, Those are two, birthday <laughs> parties, are two baby showers, um, graduations. Weddings. Weddings. All kinds of things. So they make from scratch these amazing cakes. And you actually can come in and show off some of the things, ideas that you, you want, and they'll bring it to life. So they actually let you be a part of the decorating process. It's so much fun. These guys are fabulous. And it's not, it's, it's not just a cookie cutter thing. You can really, right. yeah. Pun intended. Cool. Yeah, <laughs> cookie right. cutter. I guess we got to go, but this has been fun. Yes, yes. Thanks for uh, watching today. I want to thank all of our guests here today in Wisconsin Family. We're at Rosie's Coffee Bar and Bakery, and we'll see you next time.